welcome or welcome back to Life on the Fringe. Today we are celebrating Easter in the way that we know how, and that is with the Dollar Tree. Last year we went through and tried all of the Dollar Tree's Easter candy. We'll link that video at the end. Um, but this year they have a new candy that is not just a candy, but also a toy. And we thought, if that's not our brand, I don't know what is. So that is this game right here. And yes, we added a second camera because we are professionals now. And you may ask, why, why am I standing? That's because I got this dress from Marshalls, and I'm pretty excited about it. And I feel like it's very Easter-y. But now I'll sit down because this is time to work. This is time to focus. Because this is like candy meets Lego. And we, didn't know, we need to know if it works. So, uh, let's look at the packaging. So, this says, um, build, focus, focus, build yummy fun. <laughs> uh, and then it says, play, create, eat which is wild. And then the, they have... It's a 4D. So it's... Th I love this. Go back to the pack shot. On the front, it says 4D in the middle, but then it's 3D, and the third dimension, the fourth dimension, is delicious. I guess, because like in cinemas, when something's 4D, it's because it moves. Which right. Which makes like no sense. It's right. not... Nothing in this world that we can perceive is 4D. Right. This is 3D and also delicious, like every other food that you ever eaten. Yeah. <laughs> every food is 3D and delicious. <laughs> like Listerine strips? They're still 3D technically, but yeah, that's about as close as you can get to a 2D food. <laughs> um, so the examples I have on the package are you have this chick. We think that this is a bunny this like demonic looking thing. very scary thing but we think it's a bunny you have a carrot and another chick so i'm i hope we can make all four i'm worried about how some of those are flat on the front of pack so the the rabbit looks a little flat and the duck on the other side looks a little flat Ah, uh, so you don't think they'll, like, stand. Well, there's a, the duck, one of the ducks looks like it's standing. So I'm hopeful that the, we can this achieve one. This, this that one. one. Yeah, yeah, that one looks actually like a 3D structure. But I'm worried that they just, for some of them, like, the bunny ears are just floating in space. So they're, like, saying it's, it's kind of, it's like a pseudo 3D structure. So it's even less 3D less less 40 <laughs> than some 3d foods <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay here is your bag of bricks we got our bag of bricks bag of bricks okay so <laughs> there's 40 written all over the bag yeah <laughs> i want to know what these bricks look like and i don't want to like damage yeah, because, like, the structural integrity of our chicks depend on me not breaking this. <laughs> Ooh, oh, I'm going to like these. I love this smell of gummy. They do have a very gummy. Good gummy smell. We need paper plates. We're going to be eating these. Because for it to be 4D, it needs to be delicious. That's the fourth D. That's the, really the D that matters. I don't care where it is in time and space. I just want it to taste good. <laughs> Give me the D. <laughs> Give me the D, the delicious D. Okay, so the Lego blocks, as you can see, do look like Legos. It's kind of wild. Let me see this. Oh, wow. They have, yeah, they have the holes on the bottom. Yeah, like this is the front. And then there's holes on the back. Okay, so do they stack, though? Well, that's what we got to find out. And there's 
other there's no directions because it's the dollar tree these two are like together already so i think we need to look at the pack i don't know if we can build any of these like uh, we need more yellow pieces here there's a lot of green what's green in the pack carrot I bet you we can build carrot. But the way that they did the carrot is very like look at the strings on the carrot. Uh, the see the leaves. What so is they've that? cut it. They cut the brick. Yeah, you're right. Same thing with the orange. Right. So I think the carrot is probably our most accessible. But they didn't stack it either. That's definitely yeah. That's lying definitely just laying. Side. That's just laying down. So we need to try and build this chick. Right. Okay, so give me directions. You tell me how to build, and I'll build. Okay, so we need... What goes on the bottom? Either two three-by-twos. How about a two-by-six? A two-by-three? Two-by-three, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's the one I'm talking about. Okay. The orange is preferable. These are the feet. Oh, okay, I got it. Two-by-three. Right, two of them. Two of them. All right, hold on. I got to clear the way so that people can see as we build right right what's going on i'll right. make this video bigger <laughs> we're we're trying new technology here <laughs> life okay. on the ad franched advanced yeah okay turn them yeah okay great okay now we need um, the layer now goes on top it's going to be two two by twos two these are the legs of orange yellow ideally they have them as yellow we this only have chick is going to turn green at some point okay what if we made the the legs you could make them orange i'm gonna make the legs orange yeah you can see you can see that <laughs> that they stack into each other kind of focus all right i'll go to this other better camera you see that do you see no because it's shiny but it does some they 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 seal. They do seal. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Okay, so now we need three. Hmm. All right, they did something a little weird here. Mm hmm They have a. Th we don't have enough three by ones for this, so we're just gonna go with. Uh, sorry, th whatever. We'll just do the three by three, one, two by twos, two by twos. These two by two yellows. Yes. Three two by twos. So it's bigger than the feet. Yes. Okay. So it needs to hang on. Yeah, it's going to hang on. This is the test. That looks pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Those are the wings. Give me the next layer before they Two fall. by twos. Two two by twos. We're going to have to switch to green. <laughs> okay. Now, a one by two, a three by two pointing towards the camera... Oh, wait, a one by two. Yes. Okay. And then a three by two. Take that orange one. Yep. And stick it out towards the camera. Where's this one go? Next to it. On the right. Yeah. Yep. So this goes here? Yep. And this goes here? Yep. And then another one goes to the left side of it. A one by two. A one by two, yeah. Okay. Okay, then two two by twos. Green. Okay. And then on the top, you put whichever one by two you like the most because it's yellow or it's orange, right? Yeah, I'll do yellow. And where does this one go? Towards the front. Like this? Yep. Yep, there you go. You got it. That is the chick on the box with a green head. Here's our chick. Here's the comparative. the same thing it's just literally the same thing <laughs> i am impressed that it is structurally fairly sound it's a little wobbly but it survived being picked up on this plate yeah it worked I, it did work is it, it is legos and candy what i'm disappointed in is the the coloring <laughs> okay, he's disappointed too <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you were beautiful. 
I'm so sorry, you little bird. Okay, and if you like to play with your food, they come apart, and then yeah, you can... Yeah, you can build something else. Build something else. It's very innovative, for a dollar. Um, but how does it taste? Time for the... Wait, hold on. We'll move this guy. Don't need this as much. Time for the fourth D. The Take fourth us to D. the fourth D. Here we go. This Is it going to be Easter Bunny ear approved? Are we starting with green? I don't know. All right. Cheers. I'm going to do the two by ones. Okay. Cheers. I'm full send. Well, no, I'm not full send. Full send into the two by three. Mm, that's a lot of gelatin. It's a lot of gelatin. Oh, not a lot of flavor. No. But it's not bad. Yeah. It's a gummy. It's not like a bad flavor. Yeah. It's just it's just not very flavorful. It's 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 very chewy. It's hard to for me though to to rate gummies when I know the best gummies out there and this is not sponsored but the best gummies Stan can confirm are Albany's gummies. They're very good. Oh my goodness, they're life changing. You think Haribo is good? No. Albany's. See if they have it near you. Delicious. Let's um, break into the yellow, shall we? Yeah. Okay. Here's yellow. I we didn't chew it. It's okay. No. It's lemony. Yeah. It picks up at the end. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So they did try to make it different flavors. Yeah, it's a dis it's a distinct flavor from the green. Yes. I don't know what the green was. Apple probably, or lime. I don't think it was apple because I don't like apple. This is very distinctly lemon though. Yes. Okay, orange. Orange. Cheers. Also citrus. But orange. Yeah. Fruit forward. That one had the most flavor. Yeah, for sure. Orange was the best. Then lemon yeah. had the second strongest flavor, but I prefer green. I'm not a huge lemon fan. Yeah. But in terms of strong flavor profiles. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. what do you, Overall, 1 to 10, what do you think of this Easter candy? Um... I think it's a good Easter craft. You have kids coming over and you need them to do something for a dollar. You this could is, get a bunch of them. They could really stack a bunch. This is pretty solid. Yeah. And not messy. I mean, right. like, I'm looking at the plates. It's not sticking. Right. It's not, like, staining my plate. The, the gummy quality is not awful. No. I was expecting worse. And the they, they work. They, like... They do stack. It's the promise. I, I think it's for a dollar, it's a great value. Yeah. Dollar twenty five. For a buck twenty five. For a buck twenty five, it's a great value. So I would give it a nine. I would agree. I would say this is a nine out of ten candy activity. Yes. So bravo, Dollar Tree. Bravo. Thank you for the four D experience. Truly. <laughs> um so if you want to see our review of Easter candy from last year, uh, put that video right here. Uh, if you want to see more of our content, click subscribe, ding the bell button, and most importantly, I hope you have a wonderful day. And if you celebrate Easter, a happy Easter. Bye. Bye.